Hello and welcome back to Pentucket Jeopardy. All right, I'm gonna go Pentucket 300. What teacher is the head of the science department? Miss Knight. That is correct. Ava, it's your turn. What question do you want to choose? Uh, Pentucket 400. What is the name of the custodian that retired last year? Hint, it was a male. I don't remember. The answer was Wayne. Mr. Bixby. Take Pentucket 200, please. The Pentucket girls basketball team was, na was last named Cal Champs in what year? Last year? 2023? 2000, yeah. The answer was 2020. That's what I said. That's not what you said. Go, I want to hear the team. <laughs> Back to you. What floor is Mr. Jakes' classroom on? The first floor. That is correct. Uh, literature 100. This children's book follows a small caterpillar who emerges from an egg and eats everything in sight. The hungry caterpillar. I'd say that's correct. Mr. Bixby. Literature 300, please. The Great Gatsby is written by what author? F. Scott Fitzgerald. That is correct. Aiden. I go law 100. Name one right that resides within the First Amendment. Freedom of speech. That is correct. Ava. Uh, law 300. The power of the executive branch is vested in the what? President. That is correct. Mr. Bixby. Literature 400, please. Name one of the pigs from Animal Farm. Napoleon. That is correct. In. I go law 200. What is the highest court in the United States? The Supreme Court. That is correct. Ava. Law 400. The arresting officer must advise the person being arrested of these rights. The right to remain silent, the right to an attorney, etc. Your Miranda rights. That is correct. Mr. Bixby. 200, please. This novel follows the chronicles of Scout and Jem Finch as their father Atticus defends a black man falsely accused of rape. To kill a mockingbird. That's correct. Now that all the questions are done, we're going to move on to Final Jeopardy. Contestants, put in your wagers. Now I'll move on to the Final Jeopardy question. Name one of the two planets in our solar system that exists without moons. Aiden, let's see your response. Uranus, Ava, Saturn, Sir Bixby, Uranus. See the answer? Mercury or Venus? Looks like Aiden is the winner of Kentucky Jeopardy today. Aiden, congratulations. Thanks. How do you feel after winning? I actually feel pretty confident. I was coming in a little nervous, but now that I won, stakes are up. Well, that's great to hear. Thank you, and have a good night. We'll see you next week.